Welcome to Digimon Fusion. Have they done that? Surely they've done that by now. Uh, so I wasn't planning to stream today. Normally I would do uh, I would join in for uh, Wickersham's Smash streams on Friday, but uh, he didn't do it. He was too full of turkey. So uh, we're getting two days of Pokemon Infinite Fusion. I'm gonna I'm gonna keep going on this. Keep the train running. Uh, I did do some stuff after the stream yesterday. I continued trying to catch that Beldum, but, uh, boy, that sucker's hard to get. I don't know if there's any non-legendary that's harder to catch than Beldum, actually. Uh, so, I, I, found, I went, looked back at the footage, he was a morning encounter for that route, so I had to do some things, but, uh, one of his sprites kept not showing up, so what I did was I basically reinstalled the game over itself, I hope that fixed any missing sprites problems. However, it also ended up reshuffling the uh, the Pokemon. So, Rip Beldum. I didn't. I never got him. I did catch some other things, just because you know some cool stuff appears. I'm not gonna not catch it. Uh, let's see. What did I catch? Did I have Pooper? I think I had had her already. Uh, Weinja. I think that's new. Senrak. Got a, a Spinarak Centret. Unknown. Totally normal. Ordinary shaped unknown. Ordinary Morel. Which is it's Morel. It's an electric fairy type. Chimchar. Which I said I was going to get that one. Uh, Amora. Randomly showed up on that route. So, I've got an Amora. And Happiny. Happiny was after the the reshuffle happened. So, uh, I kind of want to evolve her to see what Chansey can fuse with. But like, I'm also all full up. Uh, is there anyone I'd want to get rid of? Ringo's useful. Deep D's my starter. I like Kadadude. I could get rid of Danny. Poison normal is not super necessary. We'll retire her for a little while. Is there anything we want to fuse Chansey with? Or a uh, Happiny? Not yet. I'll, I'll wait on fusing Happiny. We'll see if we find something cool for it. Uh, what else did I do? I got- I did the old man's flower quest, or as much of it as we can do so far. He had me go to, like, a couple places to pick flowers for the garden. That I assume is the place that you change the Oracorio forms, because the Oracorio there kept changing forms. It's, it's red now. Now I need to get some blue, fla blue flowers in Cerulean. Uh, hello, Darian. I am very low on balls. I spent all my money catching the stuff that I caught. Uh, how many do I have left? I think I'm down to four. Three Pokeballs. Because uh, many of them... So that was what I was ultimately trying to catch Beldum with at the end. Was three or four balls. And that's very, very difficult. Oh, one thing I do want to do is... Uh, I think... I want to change my starter's fusion because we've seen that it is a uh, we've seen that it's the wrong uh, it's it's an automatically generated sprite and the other form is custom so uh, I kind of want to change it to that one but I'm gonna wait until I have 300 bucks so I don't have to uh, so I don't have to use two of the DNA splicers. I, uh, actually, I set it overall so that now it will be only custom sprites. I don't know if that affects what I'm allowed to evolve, to fuse, rather, or if it's just uh, the Pokémon that we'll encounter in the wild and the trainers will have, but uh, they should all be just the custom sprite ones now. Group of thugs with bullying Pokémon. 
This poor Geodude was particularly badly injured. What is there like? What did they go go to a go to with a pickaxe? <coughs> oh, Brock the Breeder is here. You might be able to treat it better than I can. You're the rock expert. So this, I guess, adapts a little bit of anime Brock. Or he's all about Pokemon care. I'll be busy treating this Geodude's injuries, but someone needs to go investigate who's behind all these attacks. This wasn't in Fire Red Leaf Green. I should point out, this is all new to this version. They added this, like, pre-Mount Moon plot. Oh, there's a lot of trainers in here. Well, that's good, because I need money. Uh, let's put Ringo in front. Let's get some EXP. Oh, wait, no, never mind. These are, these are beaten trainers. They're already taken care of. Wow, Mount Moon is small now. I'm good without Pineco. I gotta be so conservative now because I only have three balls left. Is this anything? No, just, just a tree. Why are there trees in here? I guess they're not trees, they're mossy rocks. Very uh, suspicious bell sprout. I still don't know how I feel about all the different sprites in this game. I think I would prefer a little bit if it was, uh, if there was just one official sprite for every Pokemon, but hmm. I guess options are good. I think I am going to opt for the more official looking ones and not the jokey ones for the future, though. I kind of wish I could set it on an individual basis. Like, my my Pichu could be the one with the, with the banjo, but all the others could look normal. Okay, well, I guess now I have to catch it, don't I? Uh, Dragon Rage is going to kill it. Astonish is probably. Should I... I guess I should switch to, uh... Let me be safe and switch to, uh, to the Jillis. Maybe it'll get paralyzed. When the baby Pokemon evolve. Dead on Bell Sprout. Oh, that looks weird. Graceful Bell Sprout. Also graceful Bell Sprout. Many of them are graceful. Uh, I'll just I'll just stick with the, the regular one. I bet that has some weird. Oh, okay. I'll bet it. I'll bet it evolves because uh, it levels up with an oval stone. Hello, Fawful. I hear you're a secret boss in Brothership. You got to. Uh, you got to use strength on the truck to fight Fawful. Oh, the, 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 it's a red it, Pokemon. Red blue sprite. That looks weird. That eh, default's fine. <coughs> so 
sorry if I was silent for a little while. I was, I was dealing with Mr. Comedian. Uh, beating all those trainers is almost too easy. We're almost invincible as a group. Just wait until the boss's new project is fully operational. Is, is it a Master Ball? Is it a Mewtwo? Are they adapting, like, anime stuff? We'll miss it if we keep wasting any more time here. Oh, the, the operation is now. This isn't like a grand scheme thing. This is what we're dealing with now. Alright, well, one of these has to be Rock Smash. No? Okay. Uh... Is someone going to give me maybe maybe Rock Rock has Rock Smash? Or do I need to like ex or do I need to actually explore and like talk to random NPCs and houses? Boy, I hope I don't have to do that. Uh, I was saying, what are the chances that we got uh, Chimchar like twice in a row in the same area? Because again, all of this has been reshuffled. If I went back to the previous areas of the game, they would all have different Pokémon now. Y'all got Rock Smash? Ah, uh, what, what did I... Oh, okay. I hit something. Introduce us to Team Rocket, who we know nothing about, because we've never played a Pokémon game before. I wonder if this was someone's first Pokémon game. This move allows your Pokémon to pulverize boulders that are in the way to clear the path. All rocks are precious to me, so I don't like using this move. Ah, uh, that poor, poor, poor Brock. He must hate excavators. He feels about Minecraft like PETA feels about Pokémon. Uh, now, here's something I don't know. I may be getting this confused with Regulation Red because I was looking up stuff about both around the same time. I don't know if TMs can just be used, or if I have to teach this to someone. There's some rocks here, let's find out. No. <coughs> I have to teach it to someone. Pardon me, I, it's two weeks later and I'm still very slightly sick. Yeah, chains it with a rock smash. Uh, it's a fighting type move. Is anyone really gonna benefit from it? Should at least give it to someone who's a physical attacker. Which is Ringo, Jillis, Deep D. Not Cat. Oh, yeah, well, no. Of course, Catadude is special. He's Kadabra. Uh. This dude's got a pretty good move set. I'll replace Tackle. Ringo could use an, another move. They added plot. It was weird witnessing Brock act like later-gen Pokemon trainers. I thought he was acting like he would in the anime, like that's what they were adapting. Are we gonna ruin Misty's bike when we get to Cerulean? So you already got to this point. Jack started playing on his own just for fun. There's a Linux version of this. Uh, how far did you get, Jack? Apparently this far. There's a Fawful Fusion with Politoed and Porygon Z. Interesting. There are reference fusions. I, uh, while I was looking up sprites for the thumbnail of the last video, I accidentally spoiled myself on one. So I may try to get it, if possible. What a sexy Slaykoff! Why that Slaykoff so sexy? I kinda want it, but, oh, I only have two balls. If I get... Hold on. I can fuse Slay King with something, and it won't have truance. Oh no! Oh! 
I forgot he encored me. Shit. Well, we'll find more. Uh, headbutt. That's damaging. Uh, do I want to replace Astonish, though, for just a normal type move? It's kind of nice having a weaker move for stuff like this, for, uh, for catching. You know what? I'm gonna, st I'm gonna stick with it because I, I need the catching moves right now. What about Chansey Slaykoff? Or Slaking, because Slaking has a lot of stats. Add Chansey's HP stat onto that. Slaking without Truant. Uh, f oh, well, no. I was gonna say Fuse Slaking with Regigigas, but then you would still have to use one of their two abilities. So, that doesn't work. But, uh, yes, the two Pokémon that are ruined by their abilities. Maybe they can be fixed? Uh, the Weedle Shedinja did not have Wonder Guard. So I'm wondering if you can, if you just don't have the option to choose Wonder Guard, or if it was just stupid. I wonder if Wonder Guard inherently makes your HP stat one. Maybe that's how that works. Uh, Abrua. Okay, so it's Dark Psychic. It's it's Abra Zerua. Dragon Rage is useful at this point of the game. Oh, that's right. Jack also learned that uh, fusing the same Pokemon together gives it double EXP. And I think the reason for that is because the benefit of fusing two different Pokemon is that you have both of their movesets accessible. You don't get that benefit with two of the same Pokemon, so they had to give it something else to, uh, to compensate. That looks like way to go. Maybe. Ah, oh, this place is so big. The, uh, the fusion that I spoiled was, uh, Aegislash and Duskull. So if I want to see that on stream, I would have to not evolve Duskull. Duskull seems like it would have a lot of fun fusions with things. Just because it would turn everything into a skeleton. Cave bird. We haven't encountered any wild fusions this stream yet. I think how the wild fusions work are that you have a Pokemon that is in the... It's in the pool for that area. Shitly! Oh, I need a Shitly! He's beautiful. Uh, I'm guessing Electric Ghost. I think how wild fusions work is that you have a Pokemon that is, like, specified in the pool, like, say, it's Magikarp, and then when you encounter a Magikarp fusion, it will be a random Magikarp fusion. So the fusion itself could be almost anything. Who wants to learn Nasty Plot? No, he's a physical attacker. attacker. I guess Pichu would be learning that, but, eh, I'm good. Well, he does have Thundershock. I'll get rid of Mudslap. I have, I have other things with Mudslap. Rock Throw. It's a ground type, so it doesn't benefit that much from that, but... Uh, it's probably better than Rollout. It's more consistent, anyway. Yeah, all right. That also makes Defense Curl useless. Oh, finally, a Psychic move! <coughs> e 
Ichigo was fused with a Dust Skull. Okay, so something fused with Dust Skull makes Ichigo. Bell Skull. It's a, it's a Beldum Dust Skull. Okay, so it's either Psychic Ghost or Steel Ghost. At Dragon Rage. Which still shows super effective and not very effective, despite always dealing 40 damage for some reason. Alright, Swydower. Oh, that could be any number of the Dragon Rage. Why bother with anything else at this point in the game? All enemy types will be tossed! They don't matter! I was implying that Pokemon fused with Duskull are all hollows. Ah, oh, okay, it was a joke. I, 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 I got it. I got you. Not a lot of uh, interesting encounters on this floor. Uh, I think it was one more floor. Yeah, one more floor up. This was the one that had uh, Slay Cough. Coughing. For being one single game, and kind of not even, like, well, obviously not a mainline game either. The stupid, like, card voices from Pokemon Play It have stuck with me for life. Litish. It's not quite lit. It's just litish. Shroomish or Paris could be nice to fuse with something. Because then you could have Spore on a Pokemon that's actually, like, good. The whole thing balancing those moves is that they're on slow Pokemon. Or that that move specifically, Spore. Imagine, uh... Oh, what is this? It, it's just... Okay. I'm assuming this is a fused slow poke. This is double slow poke. It's extra good at tail fishing. That also means it's still Psychic Water. It, it looks so unnerving. Why does it look sinister? It looks like a ghost pirate. Or like a ghost sailor or something with the glowing blue eyes. Assurance? Probably not. That's worse than bite. Target has already taken some damage. Well, I don't have anything that's going to do that, so uh, I think the flinch is more useful. I should be talking to trainers after I fight them to see what they, uh... Maybe some of them have trades or something. This cave is bigger than I thought. Double spider is just a monster. A uh, Joel mask. Okay, it's Yamask and uh, Joltik. So electric ghost. Yeah. <coughs> well, he just. Uh, he just limited Ringo's uh, usefulness, especially with Bite. Jealous oh, wants to learn Fury Swipes. What do I have? Scratch? Yeah, I guess it's a little better than Scratch. Probably. It's, it's a lot less accurate. For some reason. I don't know why Fury Swipes needed to be balanced by low accuracy. Apparently, uh, the new Pokemon card pocket game, the, the mobile version of the Pokemon trading card game, is being terrorized by cards that uh, operate on, like, infinite coin flips. 
which was my strategy in the Game Boy Color game. I would get Executor, and he had a move that would just, like, it was completely broken if you just threw a bunch of, uh... Oh, that's not gonna work. It's a fairy type. If you threw a bunch of, uh... Energy cards on it. Right, what is it? It's very normal. Sure wish I had a poison right now. Or does Deep D have any steel moves? I don't think it does. No, it doesn't. But we resist fairy at least. I wonder if Sentret and Raichu have a custom fusion. Because their both their thing is both standing on their tail. Sentret and Pat Rat. Cause because they're both like they're both scouts. Oh, Magic Guard makes it immune to my rough skin. Uh, yeah, you, you mentioned that last stream, I think, that uh, we, we confirmed that Pokemon can evolve while fused. Which begs the question, do I want to prevent Ringo from evolving? Or can I choose which side of him evolves? Maybe it won't matter, because Duskull evolves pretty late. Uh, Double Slap is going to be an average of 45 damage or higher. It doesn't have amazing moves anyway. Chimfa. Uh, it's Fire Fairy. All right. Well, I have a Fury Cutter, Fury Cutter going, but that's not going to work well on this. You can do both. I did. That's the thing, though. I don't want to do both. I want Duskull to not evolve, but I do want Dino to evolve because I want to keep Duskull for that fusion I talked about. The basic layout of Mount Moon is the same, it's just a lot more cramped in this version. <coughs> Francis. Duspy. Interesting. Uh, either normal ghost or uh, normal fairy. I'm gonna hope it's normal ghost. I should probably move Ringo out of the lead. Uh, no, it must be normal fairy then. Oh, no, Dragon Rage isn't gonna affect it then. I keep picking it thinking the type doesn't matter for Dragon Rage. I'll just keep fighting it. Maybe Ringo can, uh, maybe not. Never mind. Okay, so it's normal fairy again, which we still don't have an offensive type for because I got rid of my poison. If both parts can evolve, you choose if the head or body evolves. That's... okay, that's nice. So you can make sure that only the ones you want to evolve, evolve. How does this thing bite? I guess it's theoretically still a fish. Woobat! It's so happy... it does still doesn't have arms, but it's happy to have wings at least. Uh, uh, could be any number of things. This bite bites neutral against everything. It's only one evolution per level. Okay, so the head and body can't evolve at the same level. What was the other TM I got? I wasn't paying attention. Uh, Venoshock, which is a special poison move. which none of my things can learn anyway. Thief is, I think, 40 power. Let me confirm that Rock Smash is still 40 power. Yeah, it is. Let's get you out of the lead.
right. Uh, Hearthstone. Do I have anything else useful? Rock gem. Oh, I got soft sand. Alright, well I was gonna give the hard stone to, uh, to Catadude, but uh, soft sand would be better on him. No one else has any, has any rock moves. You might notice I also sold, uh, like, all of my potions and all of my healing items and my fresh water because I was trying to scrounge up any source of money that I could to buy more balls for Beldum. And I still ended up spending most of them on other Pokémon. What's your post-battle? No. Oh, first hiker spotted. I, I do really want Slay, Slay King now. forest grind for mushrooms. Uh, I did do that a couple times as I went forward and back through there. Each one is still only worth 25 bucks, though. Mazia. It's a Marill and the, the, I think, Duosian? Or the, 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 the former form? The, the amoeba. The psychic amoeba. So it's either psychic water or psychic fairy. I also have Sketch, if anything learns any, uh, if I see any cool moves, just guess me. Nope, definitely don't want to Sketch that. Ah, bubble. Come on, do something cool. Okay, well, this thing is not a threat. Uh... I have a psychic move. I have a normal move. So I guess ideally, I would want a uh, I want a fairy move if I can find one. Some sometimes tiny mushrooms drop. I did get one of those. I think those are worth more like a hundred. Litone. Oh, 300. Okay. Yeah, I did sell one of those. Okay, so this is Psychic Fire or Psychic Ghost. Let's find out. Oh, it's got Levitate. Uh, can I switch? Psychic Fire or Psychic Ghost? I guess Catadude. Nope, I can't switch out because of Fire Spin. I thought so. Uh, well, I guess let's, uh, let's find out. Confusion's gonna be weak either way. Hound will at least hit it if it's Psychic Fire. It's Psychic Ghost. Well, this was just doomed to fail. one small hit in on it. Rip Ash's dad. Extra disturbing to call it that before it's even an adult Mr. Mime. Okay, so ground won't work. It's Psychic Ghost, so I guess Rock Throw. Got another one. Sable Ursa. That is Sable Kursta. Okay, so it's normal dark or normal ghost. Use magnitude. I can't imagine a lot of people are watching this who didn't watch the first stream, but uh, just in case. I haven't seen any of these fusions. I have uh, kept myself blind to basically everything in this game before playing it. 
except some Miltank fusions. I was not able to avoid. Miltank has a lot of very silly fusions. Jealous is evolving into Pikachu. What level is it? 15? Pika Meowth. Meowchu. Uh, that doesn't look like a Meowchu. That looks like a, like a Meow for Vendetta. Oh, some of these are weird. There's, of course, Pichu, Pikachu and Meowth are going to have a bunch of, uh, a bunch of them. I'll stick with this one. Mouse Cat. Truly a juicy contradiction. Where'd the music go? I guess we don't get any more cave music. Alright, Jillis is now in the lead, which is fine because I still want to... Let's see if I can, we can find a slake off, slake off on our way out. up since we had one Pokemon faint. I guess it's nice that it's smaller because it still has all the trainers and everything that Mount Moon originally did. But there's less walking or less distance to walk. I wonder if there's Rock Smash encounters. There are. But they're not necessarily going to be Rock Pokemon. These could be anything. Owl. Owl. It's tempting. I know Jack loves owls. I, I only have two balls, though, so I gotta be really sure that I get it, like, on the first go. Oh, uh, please, just two. Sorry. I tried. Maybe we'll find another one. Hey, there we go. Lady Owl. I guess I'll be safe this time. I'll, I'll confuse it. And I'll just keep doing that until it, uh... Hopefully hits me. I'll just think evil thoughts. Because I'm too strong to use any attacks on it. Hit me! Hit me! sure to hit, is it? <coughs> yeah. Your next attack is sure to hit you. It's fine. I, I don't really need to paralyze Hutu. It'll probably be one ball just like getting its health low. It, wow, this is the world's unluckiest Tutu. Do I really want this? Is cute Fusion 50% again? That's a good question. Because in the early games, including Fire Red Leaf Green, Confusion was a 50% chance to hit self. In more modern games, that was lowered to 30% chance. If it's 30, then that Hutu is especially unlucky. We got the Stink Eye Hoot Hoot, Mean Hoot Hoot, also Stink Eye Hoot Hoot, and uh, Dive Bombing Hoot Hoot. <coughs> I guess I probably should have named it something. Whoops. Alright, well, we have one ball left, which will be dedicated to Slaykoff. So, uh, if we find anything else cool, that'll kind of suck. I wonder if there is multiple Rock Smash encounters, or if it's just Hoot Hoot. Because, like, in Vanilla, it would probably be Geodude, I imagine. Oh, that's right, this isn't a working... What? Hold on, the nurse went back. Okay, good. Look at the move in unison. 
We are all individuals. Dude, you're blocking the nurse. Oh, I, thank you. I can sell this. Let me see what the encounters out here are, because they're going to be different. They're going to be different random Pokemon. Grab more Pokeballs. I, I would have to walk all the way back to town. Okay, there's just... There's Rockfish. I also, in addition to Pokeballs, I want to buy one of those things that uh, swaps Pokemon forms. Because I'm going to uh, swap Swordfish to its other form, which has a custom spray. Also, Water Ghost will probably be a more useful type combination. Even though Steel Dark is pretty cool. Come on, Slake off. Slack off. I, I guess it's pronounced Slack off because it's a play on Slack off, I think. Well, it's definitely supposed to be Slack anyway. There's a lot of Pokemon that uh, me and just everyone have just probably been mispronouncing forever. Because we only see them spelled and not spoken. Does no one watch the anime? I say that, people younger than me watch the anime. I, I, it was kind of ruined for me, the fact that I was here from the beginning. Because we got, like, a really stupid... Saturday morning formulaic cartoon show. And then, like, I don't know, ten years later, it became a real anime. So I never got that. I, I never made it through all the, all the, sh all the schlock to get there. Sorry, I'm trying to remember if Slaking was on this level. I'm pretty sure it was on the top floor. Go back to... No! All I, all I, we've seen all three floors of Mount Moon. All that I need in here is Slaking or Slakeoff. Like we've more or less seen all the encounters except for what's under this rock. Watch it be Mewtwo. Is this just a common thing in this world, that fish like to live under rocks? Where does this go? Oh. Fine. This is a place for us to come back later. Jack, I only need one Pokeball. Alright? We're stealing all the Moonstones. Georgia. Fargy. Fargy. Uh, this is probably not going to have a move that's like super important for me to sketch. Mimic. I'm good. It is kind of funny that this Pokemon can learn both Mimic and Sketch. And Copycat. Every possible move for, like, copying an opponent other than Transform is on this Pokemon. Uh, Smackdown is just better rock, rock throw. Probably don't want Disable. Now we're good without Disable. When I get Slaykoth, I'm probably going to fuse it with Chansey, because that sounds funny. Bulbabat. Okay, Bulbasaur and... No, it's not Zubat, it's, uh, it's Noibat. Okay, I recognize the ears. So, it's either... Oh, could be any combination of Dragon, Flying, Grass, and, and Poison. 
Let's see if it's poison. It is not poison. So it's flying and... No, it's either grass dragon or grass flying. This dude had Eradicate, originally. That was kind of annoying to get past. I guess which Pokémon is the... head? Determines what the cry is? Because I think my Pokémon is, uh... I think it's Mime Jr. Body and Smearable Head? Is what it is. <coughs> I know the gems are useful, but I never use them. Yeah, it's Smeargle Head. So, uh, cries are determined by the head. Mm, Ponyard? Again, this is a Pokemon that I've always thought has a really cool typing, but a kind of doofy design. I wish we got a Dark Steel that looked cooler than just a weird thing covered in razor blades. Uh, here's a thing I found out. This game originally supported custom trainer sprites, but unfortunately, the version that we're up to has temporarily disabled the feature. And that sucks. Because I wanted to, uh... I wanted to take uh, that one art that Darien drew of me as a Pokemon trainer. I was gonna turn that into a sprite, and we'd actually have it in-game. But, uh, I can't. Uh, okay. Now, do you sell Pokeballs? <sighs> no. Moonballs. What's in the trash? Pile of salt. Superstitious old bats. I also saw when I was looking up like trainer stuff for this game, someone has made uh, trainer Pokemon fusions. That was a thing that Digimon did. It was the uh, the fourth season, I think. The kids fused with their Digimon. I've only watched the first five Digimon series. Only. So, uh... I don't know if past that... They finally started fusing Digimon together. Surely they have by now. Hello, Lady Rocket. You can't be here! Oh, alright. Was this a Fire Red Leaf Green Spite? Sprite? I don't remember them being, like, blonde. Spin-a-skull. It's spin rack and dust skull. Uh, so it's either ghost bug or ghost poison. Let's find out. Come on, ghost poison. Ah! Yep, Digimon. Digital monsters. Digimon are the champions. Spinarak times two is amazing. I think I have a Spinarak fused with something. I think that's one of the things I caught. I would just need to catch another one. Corbat! Oh, Corsola and, Z and Zubat. Can I swap out during an infestation? Because that's like bug type fire spin. Corsola and Zubat. Ah, that's another 
possible four types. It's a combination of water, rock, flying, and poison. I guess I'll see if Jillis is... Uh, I don't want to use Jillis because I want to keep him in, in good health for the, uh, the Slate King that I'm totally going to catch with one ball. Wait, why are, why are its wings grass? Is that Corsola? Oh, because it's like, it's algae. I, I get it. Jealous. Yep. Last stream I just said, if you know, you know, but I guess I'll explain it. Uh, Jealous is a character from the anime Slayers that is voiced by the same voice actor, with basically the same voice as Meowth in Pokemon. The dub of that series shares a lot of... It, it's the same studio that dubbed Pokemon. Would you smack the scientist? You sure you want to be here for this boss? It could be dangerous. Yes, I need to oversee every single step of this personally. The results of this test could be a defining moment for the organization. I don't remember what Giovanni sounded like in the anime. I'm sorry, we're triple fusing? Oh no, you've gone too far, Team Rocket. This is unnatural. Am I gonna have to fight all these dudes? Like, in a row? Ringo, get out here. <coughs> Who let this child in here? We cannot afford any distractions. Okay, we, we have time to stop the, the, the abomination fusion. I was just looking for fossils. But they're, they're forcing the scientist to fight me. Okay. Super nerd Miguel. Honra. Honage Abra. Ugh. A psychic ghost or psychic steel. Dragon Rage. Stop! You win! The machine is finally ready. No, don't do it. Don't press the button. You monsters. Okay, it failed. Do you think there's going to be a point in this game where they try to fuse a human with a Pokemon? Is that something that t this Team Rocket is going to try? I'll let you continue your work on this triple fusion machine. Is there going to be a triple fusion in this game? Is it going to be like a boss that we can't actually catch for ourselves? Hello, Emily Cyrus. I'm okay. How are you doing? Now, the fossils probably aren't going to mean anything, because I think they count... They, I assume they count as gift Pokemon. So they will also be just a random result. Uh, Jack, when you played this, did you play vanilla, or did you randomize it? We'll each take a fossil. I like the dope fossil. I, li I like Kabuto. I think Ammonite is a little bit better as a Pokemon in battle, but, uh... There's a lab in Pewter City's museum where they do research on regenerating prehistoric Pokemon. Is that where the revival takes place now? Is it no longer on Cinnabar Island? That's sellable. Oh, 
Hold on. Let me save. I would assume because it's a flute, this is not, like, disposable, but I, I don't... I don't know what this game changes. Okay, good. Alright, now this should be the floor that Slay King, Slay Koth, was appearing on. No, this is its own area. Okay. I assume, unless we just didn't happen to run into a tentacle before now. I don't know what's in here at normally. Probably, like, Zubats. Alright, well... Now I have to go back, because I do... I want that slaking. This is actually a case where I the, the random randomization was pretty reserved. I could have said it so that, like, we could run into anything anywhere. But uh, we're only going to run into things that are, like, comparable in level to what the original Pokemon encounter was. Which is why we've mostly only run into first form so far. One thing I'm sad that I didn't catch was, uh, before I did the reshuffle, I happened to run into a route Pokemon that was fused with a Bagon. And since Bagon wasn't a route Pokemon, I was never going to find another one of those. I, I wish I had caught that. I used the option to choose my starter, and you know what I chose. You chose Snorlax. What was the... You said there was a fusion that I had to get. It was Snorlax and something. You wanted me to see. I want to... I want to see if there's a Slow Brothers fusion. I, I want to fuse uh, Snorlax and Slowpoke. This is very important. There he is. Look at that smug smile. Oh, you started with Meowth. Interesting. Or, uh, you wanted me to fuse Meowth with Snorlax. <sighs> Don't, yawn. Don't yawn at me. Damn it, now I gotta switch. <coughs> Alright. Uh... Astonish, because that won't affect him. Now I can safely switch in, because he'll be on his truant turn. Now what do I want to do? I'm afraid to fury swipe. Thundershock probably probably won't kill it. Okay, Thundershock is good. I can use a couple of those. As long as I don't crit. I do need to be, like, be really sure it's, like, catchable, though, so... I'll, I'll nasty plot until maybe it, uh, it paralyzes itself. For which purpose it's fine if I fall asleep. In fact, it's better because then... Uh, I was gonna say then it won't use Yawn on me, but I forgot. Wild wow, Pokemon are stupid. There we go. Yeah, paralyze. Ah, come on. I really wish I just had Thunder Wave, but I don't. Oh, uh-oh. Now I can't use Thunder Shock because my special attack is so high. And it's also now even less likely to land a hit on me. Paralyze. Come on. Ah! The woes of having only one Pokeball left. This is basically the degree of, uh... This is basically the degree of, like, uh, anal that I had to go th that I had to use for, like, every Pokemon that I encountered with as few balls as I had accessible. This game is really limited by the fact that uh, 
you don't get any money for so long. Because uh, all of the early game trainers are like, uh, they're lasses and, and youngsters and bug catchers who give like no prize money for beating them. Who do I have who can reasonably bring this thing down? Like safely bring this thing down? Uh, I could mud slap. I might want to sketch yawn. That wouldn't be bad to have. So we'll do some mud slaps. Oh, but Ash, he's so low health. All right, Chansey then. Slack off is also unfortunately going to make this more difficult. Okay, so this uses the physics that, uh... Oh. I don't want to... In case the Encore is still going on, I don't want to use Double Slap again, so here goes nothing. Come on. Stay in the ball. It's comfortable in there. You know you want to. Yeah. We don't need sexy slake off, but we also don't need hardworking bipedal slake off. That looks weird. Uh, where's the? Okay, there's the there's like the original ones. Well, this one specifically. It sleeps virtually all day and night long. It doesn't change its nest its entire life. It sometimes travels great distances by swimming in rivers. I'll put it in the PC because I still have Chansey. There we go. Alright. Not a problem. I still had to go back to almost the beginning of the cave. Because there was not another map that was on that level. Or there was, but it was full of, full of jellyfish. Slakeoff does not have that high a catch, that low a catch rate. I hope our plan succeeds. I hope it's not going to be like we fuse it with something and that thing is forced to have true. There's also the, uh, there's the fossil bird Pokemon, Archaeops, that also has a, uh, that's the third Pokemon, aside from Slaking and Regigigas, that has a self-sabotaging ability that you're stuck with. So that's one that you could have and remove the ability, hopefully. Flowers that Flower Man wanted. Grab one of those. It's gonna be a while before I'm back in a pewter, but is this a rock climb wall or is this a bicycle wall? I wonder. Hold on, what's this? What's all this said? Warm out moon? Is this like a convenient way back? Is that what this is? Nugget! Well, I'm glad I came in for that. Another hard stone. Those are strength rocks, so I can't do anything with those. Sandstorm. Eh. 
There's jellyfish in here, right? This gotta be the jellyfish map. No? There's nothing in here? There's a cave that's completely uninhabited by wild Pokemon? How does- how does this exist? It also looks like they, uh, they modified the map so that you can go back from Cerulean. It's not a, a one-way road. I'm just standing on top of the flowers. Layers are really just a suggestion. Wait, no, this has layers. This works. Was it? Okay. They just, they didn't do the layers correctly. This feels like Smash. For awesome nuts. Where you just really want it to be good. But you can see all the seams. I'm a clown! Thank you, clown. Would you, would you like to hear a joke? I feel like I'm gonna regret this, but okay. Which Pokemon has the least fat? Butterfree! Because it doesn't have any butter. No. You know Professor Oak, don't you? I heard his assistant over there talking about you. Okay. Me specifically? Special move for starter Pokemon. Uh, no. We, we don't want the pledge moves. Hey, you've been doxing me? If you've fused Pokemon at least five times. Yep. I've... Oh. Well, great. That's weird because I are... Okay. I already have... I'm on easy mode, so it already has the EXP share for everybody. But I guess that's more for, uh... I guess that's more for uh, the other difficulty modes have the, the traditional EXP share you can use. Oh, okay. So specific stats come from each the, uh, the head or the body. The head gets special stats and the bottom gets physical stats. So what do I have? Okay, probably better that Duskull has the special ones. Uh, Jillis is totally backwards, unfortunately. Deep D? Well, they're both physical, so that won't make a huge difference. Uh, probably backwards. Would probably benefit more from Mime Jr. being on the head. Catadude has it right. Special on top, physical on bottom. Let me, uh, let me, let me go buy some stuff. Let me go sell some stuff. Now that we're in town... And we'll have money. Huh? Electro Bro. I fuse Slow Bro with a fast Pokemon to offset its weaknesses. What are you selling? Gem, Netball, Pretty Wing. Yeah. Alright, what can we afford to sell? Uh, get rid of all these. Get rid of my one tiny mu- 200 for the tiny mushroom. Escape rope is better to sell. Rock gem. I'm gonna sell the- sell my gems. Sell my star piece. I finally have so much money. Sell one of my hard stones. what it's like to be able to afford things. Uh, I guess I'll keep the, the healing items. I'm not short for money now, so I should be fine. Now I'm gonna save, just in case I buy something stupid. And before anything, I'm gonna buy a DNA reverser. There we go. Use that. Deep D, you're getting a custom sprite.
new swordfish is. More of a fish sword, really. Carriage. Carriage. Carvana and Honage. It it the the sword is like is the fin on top of Carvana. Sword Savage Pokemon. Alright, now let's see what its stats are. It's water ghost type. Uh still physical attacker. As good as it should be. It has no guard. I should be using that more. I should be giving it inaccurate moves that are, like, just really powerful. Uh, Water Ghost. So, Bite is no longer gonna be Stab. Aqua Jet will be, though. Use a Reverser on Jillis? Do I want to? Alright. We haven't seen, uh, other form of, uh, Meowth. Pikachu. So let's see what that is. It would, in theory, be better statistically, because Pichu, the special attacker, would be on the bottom. Let, let's look at the stats first, just for comparison. Uh, Jillis. Uh, 23 attack, 20 special attack. Hello, Fawful Chortles. Alright. Pikath. That looks like what I would expect Pikachu Meowth to look like. And it's even got a few different sprites. That one looks generated. Uh, which one do I want? This one doesn't look bad. Yeah, I kind of like this one. Alright, now what are its stats? Uh, they actually kind of got worse. A little bit. His special attack rose by one, but his physical attack dropped by one. Eh. A mixed attacker, I guess. Uh, Ringo is fine. <sighs> Holy Bash is dead. This mascot is definitely a lot cuter than the Pichu Meowth was, like the other Pichu Meowth that we didn't get. Uh, let me buy ten Pokeballs in tens, as one does. And I want lots of these. I'm gonna get 50, so I, I really don't run out for a while. And then... Yeah. I'll, I'll start with 10 DNA splicers. Because I don't want to, like, have zero money again. I'll sell these because I, I don't use them. Basically, if I buy in 10s, I get 100, I get 100 bucks off. Uh, do a little organizing. Don't really need things like antidotes and paralyzed heals because I have berries, but. Uh... What? What sigh? What did I do wrong? Deposit some stuff, so I don't have to carry around, uh... Where do I want to deposit? I don't need the EXP share. Dome Fossil. Save the Moonstone. Yeah, that's fine. I wonder how big the item space is. Okay. Now, I want to fuse Chansey and Slake Slakoth. So, special is on top, right? Yeah, so I would want Chansey on top and Slaking, Slake Off on bottom. 
hopefully that's a custom sprite. Use which splicers? Are there different types of splicers that do different things? I wonder if there's anything that Amora would be good to mix with. Uh, hmm. Well, I don't know which is which. But this one has the custom sprite, which means I want it. <coughs> Chankoff. Chanky Kong. Chanky Kang. Uh, okay, there's a few variants of Chankoff. I, this one's auto-generated, but I kind of like it anyway. Uh, that's fine. Slacker Egg Pokemon. Definitely don't want Truant. Uh, plus special defense. Mm. Yeah, it's not gonna have good speed anyway. All right, Scratch and Pound are redundant. Who cares? Double Slap. Sure, I guess. Again, better than Scratch, at least. Very slightly. Copycat. Don't need Copycat. <coughs> and Refresh. Oh, I have Slack Off and Refresh. I've got a Pokemon that's just great at healing itself. Okay, good. Chansey is on top in this fusion. I'm, I'm glad about that. I hope they prioritized giving custom sprites to, like, fusions that make sense. What type is this? Pure Normal? Also, this one's still male, even though Chansey is all female. I don't know why that is. So far, most fusions are gender neutral, I've noticed. Okay, so it's still pure normal type. Oh, I can walk behind this building, but not this building. I saw two Pokemon fused together in the wild by themselves! You know what? Let's go fight this, uh, let's go uh, fight this Electro Bro. Hold on. Is this a Team Rocket, dude? There have been reports of criminal activity on Route 5. Okay. Maybe it's not Team Rocket. Maybe it's a policeman. I can't tell because it's the back of the sprite. Uh, hold on, let me see who, uh, who I've got out. It's gonna be Electric Water or Electric Psychic, so... Hey, Catadude. Let me put him out here. Ace Trainer? Cool Trainer. Oh, she's got a Legendary Fusion. Okay. I thought it was just going to be the Electro Bro. It's Groudon Unknown. So it's going to be Ground Psychic. Ground Psychic. A ghost would be good, but it doesn't have a ghost move. Dark would be good. I don't have a safe way to switch in, but uh, Ringo, here's hoping. Ringo is now Slowgo. Ground Psychic. Let's give him a good bite. Oh, that's gonna suck. Not very effective, because I'm a dragon. That's that's super effective. Oh, why am I even using... I should just be using Dragon Rage. That's gonna deal more than Bite does. Deep D does have dark a dark move. 
Give him a sword dance first. Oh, that's right. Well, that's not very effective. That was not very effective? Uh-oh. I don't think I'm ready for, uh... I don't think I'm ready for Groudon Unknown yet. Especially since it outlevels me. I could try to sketch Lava Plume. That's probably not worth it, though. Yeah, lower accuracy. Jillis is going to be weak to ground type. Oh yeah, she's styling. He's styling. Give give him a yawn. Yeah, yeah, get drowsy. And dead. Oh, it survived. Slack a little bit. Double slap is my only attack move. Just smack this legendary symbol around. Oh, come on, do more than two. <coughs> and there goes even double slap. Well, Jillis. Well, it's Psychic Ground, right? Do I have anything that will... Ground will still work. How did you can just hit it normally? I was waiting for her to use, like, a full restore or something. Because that is part of the hard difficulty. Trainers can use items. levels from that. Jillis wants to learn to screech. Uh, partially reduces defense, but my only attack move is Fury Swipes. That could help al allies, at least, against like a tough po opponent like this. I kind of feel like that would be useful more often than Nasty Plot, but I don't know. Oh man, I have to actually choose now. It's, it's can, Sweet Kiss is only 75% 70, accurate. This is 85% accurate. Would Confusion or... You know what? Lower Defense is going to benefit my team more often. Wait, now I thought I was fighting Electro Bro. Oh, because it's randomized. Fusion balls. I was confused. I thought, oh, she has two Pokemon. I must be fighting the Electro Bro next. No, it was complete random chance that she happened to have a legendary. I thought it was programmed because she was a cool trainer. I mean, maybe it's maybe it's a common trait of cool trainers, even in the randomizer. I guess they would have like uh, since it works on stat totals. Since they'll have Pokemon with high stats, they'll randomize into Pokemon with high stats. Careful not to fall in the pool. Really? No. You lied to me. I th I thought I could go swimming. All right, well, this is not necessarily a water gym anymore. Let's see what type Cerulean Gym now is with its indoor swimming pool. Brock was an ice type trainer. Swimmer Lewis and now Rat Puff. Okay. Well, that's horrifying. I'm guessing it's either then normal or fairy. Oh, that sucks. 
I might not want to use Slowlax yet. Slowlax might not have the moves yet to be useful in battle. Might need something better than Double Slap on Slowlax. I don't have any fight- well, I have Rock Smash as my only fighting move. And I think that's not strong against Fairy? Uh, what am I- I don't have anything good against Fairy. Fighting is neutralized. I don't have any Steel moves and I don't have any Poison moves. So I'll just, uh, when in doubt, either Dragon Rage or Swords Dance. Yeah, double Swords Dance. Pony Doof. Okay, so normal type. Misty is the normal type gym leader. I wonder if it, when it randomizes them, I wonder if it ensures that we don't get two gyms of the same type. Like, we're not going to get to sell it on, and they're also going to, Erica's also going to be a normal type gym leader. Are we? I'll keep Slowlax in the back until, uh, until he's got something better to offer. So far, his only skill is keeping himself alive. What are the stats like in this game? Well, I just... We found out this stream that apparently... Togacy. Oh, it's Togepi and Chansey. Uh, apparently, different stats are drawn from different Pokemon depending on who's the head and who's the body. So this Pokemon is Smirgle Head, Mime Junior Body. So it's going to get special stats from Smirgle and physical stats from Mime Junior, which is probably the opposite of what I want. Will Togacy have anything that I want to sketch? Okay, that's fine. It's unfortunate because it means that while only some Pokemon have custom sprites, like this one does... And, uh, there's some of them, like the one I was just using, where I guess you just don't want to use because they're statistically not good. Uh, HP comes from the head, and speed comes from the body. Keeps yawning on me. Why does it- I guess Togepi learns yawn. So this is my, uh, Honedge Carvana. Oh, Togepi's a fairy type. Now, so it's gonna be this is a normal fairy Pokemon. <sighs> nope. All of its metronomes fail. Sorry, Togacy. Uh, I have this randomized so that we'll see as many things as possible. The default mode is that it's basically just Gen 1, is what this is. Uh, Dragon Breath... I Do I want to replace Astonish? It's Stab, but it's 30 power. I want to replace Astonish. It'd be good to have a Dragon-type Stab move. Ooh, Shadow Sneak. Aw, oh, man! I might have to teach something else Rock Smash. Now I'm too short on moves for this. I could get rid of Bite, because it's not Stab anymore, but it's also nice to have. I can reteach Rock Smash if I want to. Yes, Thunder Wave, finally! Uh, what are we getting rid of? Oh, that's right, this is... I like all these moves. I guess Nasty Plot only helps Thundershock. Whereas Screech can help partner Pokemon if there's something that we're having trouble taking down. Classic Ma- well, yeah, it, it's Kanto, but I assume that it mixes in other gens of Pokemon, because, you know, it's got... I 
think, seven generations? I don't think I've seen any eight Gen 8 Pokemon in this, but I don't remember for sure. Psybeam is just better confusion. Finally, we're getting some moves. Uh, normal type. Alright, I'm gonna go heal. We'll take on normal type gym trainer Misty. I'm glad she's apparently in the gym this time. I don't have to go, like, find her. Well, I get no, in Gen 1 she was in the gym. I think. Or was she just, like, gone on an errand or something until you did Nugget Bridge? In Gen 2, she was, like, off on a date that you had to go find her on. What's your policy on Pokemon? My policy is an all-out offensive with normal types. Misty, the world-famous beauty. Aren't you, like, 12? Uh, oh, that's right. Gym battles, you only get two Pokemon. It's two on two. So... Who do I want for this? Probably not Ash's dad. Ringo will be good, because he's a ghost type. Actually, I have two ghost types. Is Ringo ghost? Yeah, he's ghost dragon. Probably just bring in my two ghosts. Yeah. Alright. Uh, Ringo and Deep D. I'm gonna start with Deep D, actually, because, like, sword dance is good, uh good immediate strategy. Machine or anime outfit? Oh, no. She's just in a, a new custom outfit. Ditteen! Okay. I was gonna say that's not normal, but Ditto is normal, so it's either normal water or normal flying. If it turns into me, it's going to be Water Ghost, which means I have Bite, which will be super effective against it. But it's not going to transform. Uh-oh. Don't confuse. Okay. Uh, man. I guess... It's using wing attack, so I'm going to bank on it being normal flying. Maybe Auto Jet will, Aqua Jet will take it out. Okay, good. Mantine reduced to Pidgey typing. Automatize raises speed. I have been having speed problems, and Fury Cutter is... Oh, it's 40 base power. That's nice. Is Fury Cutter worth keeping, though? I don't feel like it is. It is coverage. We don't have any other bug moves. And, like, are we gonna both Swords Dance and Automatize? Are we gonna have time for that? I think I want to keep Fury, to Fury Cutter for the coverage. Fury Cutter looks to be buffed. Is it still 20 power in the regular series, even like in Gen 8, Gen 9? <sighs> Screech is also tempting, but... Swords Dance is, is generally more useful for this kind of thing. <coughs> Jiggly-own. What a wonderful choice of a, of a Pokémon for your, your two Pokémon to use in this battle. Oh, this is a Psychic type. Am I gonna be faster, though? I... think it... did it use Scary Face on me? I don't remember. I'm gonna risk a bite. Oh, she's faster. But it didn't take me out. Okay, I'm good. I can't believe I lost! Fury Cutter. Now, in Vanilla, 
this would be Water Pulse. But despite the text, it's not Water Pulse. What is it? TM55. Oh, it's not 55. We got Double Team. That's nice to have. Uh, I could make Slowlax even better at self-sustain. Anyone can learn it. I guess if I have someone who just has a free move. Unknown. Yes, Unknown do have very shit stats. Unknown are a candidate for, like, worst fully evolved Pokemon. Pro they probably are the worst fully evolved Pokemon. Uh... This is Technician, so it's it's good, actually good that I have weaker moves on, uh... On, uh, Ash's dad. Could get rid of Mud Slap. Especially since this is, uh... Better Mud Slap if I'm keeping him in the match. Everyone else kinda already has pretty full move sets. Catadude could, well, get stab for Mud Slap, but, uh... Yeah, I'll keep Mud Slap on Catadude, and I'll give a, uh, I'll give Mime Smeargle double team. Uh, Fury Cutter is currently forty power. It was ten power in Gens two through four, and it was buffed to twenty in Gen five. They oh, that's real nice. Thank you, Gym Trainers. Forty is enough base power to make uh, Fury Cutter feel worth it. I'm happy with forty. All right, well that's two, Jim. Uh, that's two badges so far. Oh, that's right. There's a rival encounter. I caught a bunch of strong and smart Pokemon. <coughs> Hafrua. So beautiful, so majestic. Poison Dark. Uh. Poison Dark. And I can't use Ground Catadude because he's also psychic. Ringo is Ghost Dragon. Deep D is Ghost Water. I don't have anything that I can switch into for Poison Dark. I'm gonna bet on it not using a Dark move. Because I'm, I'm currently a fairy type, I think. Am I fairy type? Yeah, I'm fairy type, so it's probably not going to use a dark move. Okay, good. Don't poison. Ah! Damn it. I forgot Coffin can have Levitate. Alright, uh, Poison Dark, so Psybeam won't work. Well, this was, this was an effort and futility. Uh, let's just throw some rocks. Oh, wait, oh! Oh, it's on the ground now. I have more synergy than I realized. Yeah, fuck you and your levitate. That's probably all Catadude's gonna do. Unless it's faster than, uh... Mymino! Oh, he's got the... He's got two of my Pokemon, but differently fused. Mime Jr., so it's either... Uh, could be any combination of Psychic, Fairy, Dragon, and Dark. Well, it's not gonna have levitate. So let me just get a uh, let me just get a, a good hard hit in. Yeah, Catadude. Uh, soft boiled. It already has slack off, which is basically the same thing. It is the same thing. 
Except that uh, soft boiled can be used in the field, so. Oh, there he goes. Catadude poisoned to death. Uh, Ringo, why don't you get out there? Yeah. My turtle. Mareep and War Turtle. Electric Water. Uh, I don't have anything super against that, but I always got Dragon Rage. Joke's on you, I'm already slow. Yeah, Super Potion. Waste, waste your turn. Waste your healing items. Desperately trying to make Ringo even slower than he already is. Bunfer, yeah, Bunferno. Oh, that's right. He had a he had a like a bunnyery chimchar before. So that's normal fire. That I also have nothing amazing against. So Dragon Rage. Does this work? Endure on a. It does. On a move with set damage. I wasn't sure if it would or not. No, we don't need Encore. Get out of here. Take it easy. You won already. You don't even have six Pokemon yet, dude. Uh, you know what we haven't done? We haven't checked the grass west of town. Let's see what's over there. Oh no. Oh, come on, dude. Really? <sighs> All right, what's over here? It's gonna be Mewtwo. Oh, that's another Duskull. So normally, in vanilla, red, or fire red, or whatever, what would be here? It'd be Ekans and Spiro, and I think maybe Nidoran? And I think that's unchanged in fire red, leaf green. So there's probably three Pokemon in this. Now they are Duskull, Unknown, and... There's also morning day night encounters, so. These are Oh! Yes! Yes, yes, yes! Okay, uh I saved before I went in the grass, didn't I? Jillis, you are gonna paralyze. Jack, what are you talking about? It's a very normal canon to the series unknown shape. Nothing weird about it. Uh, you know what? I could have used Yawn, actually. I don't know how strong Thundershock is gonna be. So I'll give it a- I'll give it a Fury Swipes. Now, conveniently... Once it's down low enough, I can switch to a Ghost-type, and then I don't have to worry about it killing itself. Ah, oh, I got bad luck! No! Well, this is going to be way more common an encounter than whatever its rate was in the previous place we found it. So now that we know it's there, let me heal up and we'll, uh, we'll go in with Jillis from the get-go. What would I fuse build him with? It doesn't get any moves, but, uh... I do want it in the party so it'll get, like, experience and grow into a, you know, Metang Metagross. I could put Duskull away and fuse it with, uh... Fuse it with Di With Dino.
Okay, so there's four encounters here. Maybe there were rat attack here in the original game. Or maybe there's just more encounters than there are in the original game. Smooch him. We do have the luxury that we can basically catch anything we find now. Now that we have, like, actual money to buy and use Pokeballs. Oh, please just do two. I should just open with Fury Swipes. So that I know whether it's worth even using a Thunder Wave. Alright, Beldum. Ooh, that's good. Yes! We lo- oh. Now- wait. Is it gonna kill itself if it hits me? It's level 8, so it doesn't have a lot of HP, but I- I kinda need to paralyze it to catch a Beldum. Beldum suck to catch. Okay, good, it missed. Uh, Ringo. Get in there. You can't hit me. I'm a ghost type. Fusion ball. Works better on fuse Pokemon. Interesting design, that ball. I wonder if the GS ball is in this. Probably not. I feel like that's a thing that a lot of fan games would add. Oh, now I catch it within two balls. I spent so long trying to get this thing off stream. Weird. Grabby, Beldum. Uh... Is this just, like, darker Beldum? That's a, is it all, positioned a little bit differently. Uh... I, I'd like to like the default. Iron Ball. Put it in the PC. Uh, I kind of want to nickname it, but I don't have any ideas. Fortunately, we can always change nicknames in the menu in this game. Very easy to change nicknames. I think I'm gonna do that. I think I'm gonna put Duskull away, because I want him to stay Duskull. And we're gonna add, uh, we're gonna fuse Dino and, uh, Beldum. That, unfortunately, that will reduce Dino to level 8. Well, it'll reduce the fusion to level 8. I'm thinking if there's anyone I do want to replace. So far, everyone's been pretty... Jillis is extremely useful for catching. Ash's dad has not been amazingly useful, but... I don't know, that could change. It's got sketch. Uh, what, move, what moves is it going to lose from this? It's going to lose its ghost typing. Uh, yeah? Confusing? Oh, okay, I had to I can press A, I guess. What moves does it keep from that? Okay, it got some of its old moves back, or maybe it learned whatever its last two moves that it would have learned by level up are. And Duskull has Yeah, it relearned Disable and Foresight. Unless it had that before and I just forgot. All right, Beldum, we're gonna double up on pseudo legendaries. Uh, which one do we want on top and which on bottom? 
Beldum, Metagross is pretty mixed for attacking stats. It's not very fast, though. So, speed would be body, ideally. Dino just has okay speed. Uh, more physical attack. Physical stats are body, and special stats are head, so I think I want Dino on bottom. I say before I do this, just in case I, I get the wrong one, because it doesn't it, like explicitly say which is which when you do the fusion. Alright, fuse. Uh, okay, it's got either one. I want Dino Body and Beldum Head, so it looks like this is the one I want. Steel Dragon is a pretty cool typing. Could be useful. Alright, Dino Beldum. Yeah, Belno. Belsi? Belno. Irate Ball Pokemon. It is, an, it is a little ball of anger. Boosts attack but lowers accuracy. Mm, clear Body could be nice. Prevents stats being lowered. That activates a lot. I kind of don't like the reduced accuracy of Hustle. It's not going to be fast, and, like, regardless, I might as well get the attack boost from Brave. Uh, why did I even combine? It, it only has takedown. I could replace Headbutt. I get for Focus Energy, even. I'm not going to use Focus Energy. Get rid of that. Uh, is this... Okay, the, the sprite doesn't update until... Here, here? Yeah, okay. Uh, so, yeah, it's Beldum Head and Dino Body. Which is what I want. Okay. Any good, uh, any good things I could teach it? Could even Rock Smash back now that, uh, it doesn't have its, like, really good ghost moves. I'm gonna keep Takedown, because I'm probably not gonna be using Normal most of the time anyway. Uh... Hold, where did Dragon Rage go? Oh, it replaced... Why did it replace some of its moves? I didn't give it permission to do that. I know Dragon Rage definitely wasn't a, a Duskull move. Oh, that sucks. They got rid of my Dragon Rage. I don't like that. It is level 8 now, right? No, it's level 16. Does it stick with the higher of the two levels? Or does it, like, split the difference? I'm also kind of curious how it, uh... I guess if the stats come from those, like the head and body, I guess the IVs would as well. Move Tutor upstairs. Leap. That looks like a tortured existence. It's a uh, water and rock or water grass. Dragon Rage would be like a dragon breath is effective no matter what, so. I do miss being able to just change the order of moves in a ba in a match. Hands. Oh, it's Par it's Paris and Ekans. I, I was thinking like Charmander and Ekans, but that's not what it is. Okay, so it's Bug Poison or Grass Poison. I miss being able to change the order of moves in a match. In modern games, you have to do it from the menu.
Tylea. Tyrogan Curlia. That kind of works, weirdly enough. So it's Fighting Psychic or Fighting Fairy. Bite is going to be, like, really not very effective on Fighting Fairy and just neutral against Fighting Psychic. Oh, it's Fairy. Fighting Fairy. Okay, definitely don't use Bite then. <laughs> Charge. That looks violent when this dude use takes, uses takedown. Fun buff. Okay. Normal fairy. I think Jigglypuff is pure fairy now. Jigglybuff. Or is it normal fairy? Is it possible that it could combine and just be normal type? I'm going to assume it's fairy type and the dragon breath won't work. I did my best. I have no regrets. Let's go check out that boot tutor. What else is upstairs? I just assumed... Maybe I just assumed never go up there because it would be like the trade center, but... It's not, because you can't trade in this game. Uh, there's the move Reminder, who costs a thousand to use. Uh, I'm good. I also haven't done Wonder Trade. Pokey Athlon Showdown. Uh, I'm good. Is this the Wonder Trade area? Wonder Trades allow you to trade a Pokemon with a random trainer from around the world. It's probably not the real trainer. It's probably just a random generation. Okay, so if you use a premium ticket, I'm guaranteed to get a better Pokemon back. Stat-wise, like, stat total-wise. Uh, what do I have that I'd be willing to part with? I have two Whoopers. I have Noiper. I have two Weedles. I have two Sentrits. I don't really want to part with anything, though. I also don't have anything amazing to trade. Other than my shiny Bell Sprout, I guess. I don't want to get rid of Amora. I, I like having Amora. I'm good. I'll wait until maybe I encounter something that'll be, uh... That'll be good to trade just for stats. Uh, Belno. <coughs> okay, there's Dragon Rage. How dare you get rid of that? And a takedown has already proven useful. I guess I'm getting rid of Rock Smash again. I'm gonna need someone to have it, though, eventually. thinking about it. Uh, you can use Dragon Breath by default. Dragon Rage a lot. Bite and Takedown less so. <coughs> uh, normal Fairy type. So... Is it a special attack? It is a special attacker. But this dude just doesn't have any amazing, like, moves right now. He doesn't have anything going for him. I might get rid of Ash's dad if he doesn't improve soon. I wonder when he evolves into Mr. Mime. Because his baby Pokemon are a level evolution now, and not happiness. Although I think, uh... I think they weren't... I think Mime Jr. and Bonsley weren't happiness, originally. It was like they have to level up knowing a certain move. Maybe Mime Jr.'s, like, Barrier or something? Alright, 
a little bit more uh, comfortable move orders there. Back to Nugget Bridge. I assume we can't go through this, uh... Do we even... No, we don't go through the house anymore. We just have access to a east road. Do we even need to do Nugget Bridge? We probably still need the SS ticket. That's a way to grind for money, payday. Yeah, technically. It's a very... It's a pretty slow method. Alright, Senrock. Uh, it's Lycanroc and uh, Sentry. So it's going to be rock normal, but it's the standing like in rock. It's it's the like the midnight type, which is that also dark type? I don't remember. Dragon Rage. <coughs> I expected a like rock fusion to have more HP for some reason. Uh, do I want Amnesia? No, I, d I don't want Amnesia on Slowlax. It has so many other things to keep itself alive. Clivy! Uh, Steel Norm. Dragon Rage. Uh, oh, it was a, it was a Zorua. Disguised. So now it's an actual Clivy. I saw a fusion. I don't remember if I saw it in this game off stream, or if I just happened upon it while I was looking up sprites again. But uh, Curlia and Mareep makes a creep. That was a good one. <coughs> that Maril from earlier was a Mareep Maril, and since they both start with the same three letters. A Mareep Maril fusion can be either Mareep or Maril. Like, they're st it's still their, their names. Uh, ground water. There's Pokemon into ground water. I was thinking psychic, but no, Psyduck never gets to be actually be psychic. I wonder if Bide works with Dragon Rage. Bulldoze? Uh, it's more consistent than the Magnitude. 60 power and reduces speed. <coughs> yeah. I don't like RNG. Sand Chum. He's just a little... He's a, he's a chummy little fella. Uh, Smoochum is... So it's... Ground Psychic or Ground Ice? Oh, I don't like ice. Dragon Rage. <coughs> Why use anything else unless I'm against a fairy type? Shadow Sneak. Uh, am I a ghost? I am a ghost type, so I want that. Uh, do I want to get rid of Bite or Fury Cutter? I have... Do I have a Dark-type move on... Uh, I do have a Dark-type move on... Uh, on Belno. I still want to keep Bug for coverage, just in case we go into something that, like, Bug is going to be really useful against. Doesn't he have a Dark? Yeah, he has Bite. Sorry, I keep coughing. I don't still want to be sick. Prepare for the bomb. Fant pet. So I think that Fant... Was it a Phantom that we saw? I don't think it was actually a fusion. I don't think it was Phantom fused with the pumpkin Pokemon. I think it was just... Uh, I think it was just a, a custom sprite for Phantom that had a pumpkin for a head. Which is part of why I don't love the, the custom sprites thing in this game. At least the, the really silly ones. Uh, 
Manroth. Or it's Mangroth. It's Mankey. Fighting normal. I'm so close. Dragon Rage. Yeah. <coughs> My technique. My Manroth. Mimikyu is in it. Yeah, Mimikyu is Gen 7. As far as I can tell, this goes up to Gen 7, which is Hawaii. Camper Ethan sent out Odd Rough. Odd looking duck. Why is it floating? It's a rock dog and a piece of grass. Neither of those should have the ability to float. So it's either grass rock or poison rock. Oh no! Wake up! Wake up! Does it only know it only know status moves? It only it, it has like sleep powder, poison powder, and stun spore, and that's it. Maybe it had like tackle or something as well, and just didn't want to use it because it wasn't it's not very effective. All right. Give me my prize, obvious Team Rocket member. <coughs> There's another easy 5k. Would you like to join Team Rocket? Yes. Wait, you're the kid from Mount Moon. We don't want no troublemakers in our organization. Only clean criminal criminals for us. So yes, I saw his name was Elvis. Uh, pawn your Doduo. So it's a combination of steel, dark, flying, and normal. Dragon Rage. Oh, now I can't use the same move twice. Okay, didn't matter. Mudwig. Turtwig and Mudkip. Mudkip is not ground type yet, I don't think. I think it becomes ground type when it evolves. So this has this is water grass. Dragon Rage. <coughs> Mimikyu Gardevoir has custom sprites. Interesting. What what does an Eldritch Abomination Gardevoir look like? Is it like some sex abomination? Is it like a metaphor for STDs, Mimikyu Gardevoir? I hope that every Mimikyu fusion is like some eldritch horror. I would be so happy with that. What could be what could Cthulhu be? What's the squiddiest Pokemon? I guess it would be uh I guess it would be what would the Malamar, right? So Mimikyu Malamar should make Cthulhu. I'm looking for a Pokemon called Abra. Studying its behavior and its natural habitat, but its teleporting abilities make it very difficult to even get a glimpse at one. Uh, I'll try. I'm gonna be real, you're probably in the wrong place. Abra probably isn't here, but uh, I'll look. Clink. I'm good. I don't need a clink. I hate this Pokemon. It's a stupid Pokemon. Imagine I went out of my way to catch no Gen 5 Pokemon or fusions. Just out of just spite for the generation. Man, we just got through two... I say bad generations. Generations which I dislike significantly in uh, Gen 4 and 5. Which is why I'm eager to start the next one, because we're finally back to, you know, Pokemon games that I like. I finished Gen 4 highlights a while ago. I've been 
dragging my heels on Gen 5. They're in the works, it just, it's a lot of footage to go through because it's an RPG. Oh, I don't have Rock Smash anymore. Can, uh... Slack, Slack Chansey isn't doing anything. Never a double slap, who needs it? Oh yeah, it's stab, but who cares? It's not gonna attack ever. I'm not gonna send it out until it has another move anyway. <coughs> Look at it, it's so smug. It knows it doesn't have to fight. It knows it gets a free pass out of doing any hard work. Okay, Jack wants to show me Mimikyu Gardevoir. Alright, let me let me open my Discord. I'm ready. Oh, this is is this different grass? Yeah, this is different grass from that area down there, I think. Maybe it's just a different time of day. Or maybe I just hadn't encountered Baidoof. That's probably it. Uh... Keep Belno out in front. <coughs> My Rattata's different. It's like it's in the top percentage of Rattatas or something. Cool Rattata, bro. I do kind of like that, though. It's like a galaxy. Snubble Ghastly. A uh, Ghost Fairy, I'm assuming. Which means Bite would be neutral. It could also be Ghost Normal, but eh. So, uh, Mimikyu Gardevoir. Oh, that's right, fairy, so dragon type won't work. I guess I have to use bite for neutral. Sorry, now I have to focus, because this thing's a, a little bit of a threat. Ghost fairy. What do I have for that? Do I have anything? I have ghost. Uh, Mimikyu Gardevoir. With... Mimikyu for the head is a Gardevoir. Or it's Gardevoir sized, but it has the Mimikyu head and like a knife in the middle of it instead of its uh, instead of its horn. And uh, Gardevoir for the head is probably what all Mimikyu body fusions are. It's just Mimikyu, but the disguise is Gardevoir instead of Pikachu. That was not super effective. Ah, oh, it's it's not ghost, it's poison. It's cream from Stardust. Uh, yeah, it kinda is, yeah. Vanilla ice cream. Best JoJo character. Okay, here we go. Probably not Blissey, so it's gonna be Vyad's yeah, Vigoroth. Vigoroth and Chansey. Wait, that's a custom one? I thought that was generated. It's so ugly. I'm sorry, Frigid. Chanroth. Jackie Chan and Sephiroth did a fusion dance. And somehow this came out. Well, it's less smug now, at least. I hope it gets, like, a good move soon. A good attack move, at least. My, you don't have a rat attack. Get over yourself. Cherry berry. I've wanted one of those. That's a paralyzed heal. What is this? I can kind of see through the trees. I guess that's fine. You'd be able to, like, see through leaves. Hello, Mr. Hiker. I'll go heal. Don't have teleport, don't have fly. Just gotta walk back. 
I do want to level up Belno. I want I want Belno to evolve. Uh, Beldum evolves at a reasonable level. I think it's 25 for Metang, which is a little bit low for a pseudo legendary. I think Metagross also evolves a little bit early. Maybe it's like level is 45 or 50. Conversely, the Dino line evolves really, really late. In fact, it's some of the latest evolutions in the franchise. I think the first one might be like 40-ish, and the second, the final form is like level 64, which is shared by the Eagle and the Vulture Pokemon, and uh, I think Volcarona is 64. I want it. Lar oh, th this is... It's 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 pseudo fusion versus pseudo fusion. It's a it's, it's a Gudra prevolution, Gumi. That's what it's called. It's a Gumi and a Larvitar. So Dragon Rock or Dragon Ground? It's Dragon. Maybe she'll trade it. Metatly. Okay, so Bug Ghost or Bug Poison. Come on, Bug Ghost, Bug Ghost. Ah, it's Bug Poison. I wish the, the Pokemon that get Poison type from Ghastly would stop looking so much like ghosts. Emphasize, like, the poison gas part, not the ghost part. All oh, Pokemon have we... No, trade me your... Trade me your, your Gumatar. I want it. I think trades are randomized, so even if a trainer is willing to trade you one of their Pokemon afterwards, it won't actually be one of the Pokemon that they used in the battle. They're also pretty rare. We've only encountered, I think, two so far. Swicely. It's Swinub and Bonsley. Ice Rock or Ground Rock? I'm gonna guess from the sprite that it's Ice Rock. <coughs> Probably doesn't have a lot of HP. Oh, but it's sturdy. No, my accuracy. No, wait. Oh, because I have clear body. I can't lower my accuracy. Eh, yeah, screw you and your mud slap. Bite you. <coughs> Hound fairy. Oh, it's adorable. It's like it's like a little satanic clefairy. Fairy fire or fairy dark? That's well. It could be normal. I think clefairy. I think clefairy is normal fairy. I, I, I can only use takedown without changing Pokemon. Duobat. Duosion and Zubat. So Psychic Poison or Psychic Flying? Well, it's Psychic, so... Chomp. What an interesting but not effective Pokemon Duosion is as a concept. I may, it pro I'm sure it has some, useful, some use in battle. It's probably not useless. Eh. Psychic type walk on. Oh, Centret Amora. So normal ice or normal rock. Uh, lore wise, the thing with the Duosion line is that it's a psychic type that has psychic powers, but it prefers not to use them and to just beat shit up with its giant amoeba fists instead. It is canonically the, a scrub Pokemon. It knowingly does what's suboptimal. <coughs> I think there's one or two other Pokemon like that, but I'm not remembering what they are.
I wonder if I, get, if I get a bicycle in the same way as I would in Gen 1. Youngster Dan. That's what that's probably what my top button is. That's probably the, the register button. The bicycle. Meow Leap is a little terrifying. It's a Meowth and a Lil Leap. Normal grass or normal rock? Something about the sound effect for Fury Swipes makes it sound far away. Like, I hear it and I think it's happening outside my head headphones that I'm using. Jiggly thing. It's Jigglypuff coughing, and it has it has like little smoke hands and hearts. That's adorable. Fairy poison or normal poison? Well, I can't use dragon. I gotta I gotta be safe and use tape down. I don't think we ever got a great answer of what the consistency of a coughing was. It looks like a rock. I always thought it should be rock poison type. But I think some entries described as like balloon-like? And then I think Detective Pikachu or something. I think something portrayed it as like furry. So I don't know. so many trainers here. I mean, there were originally, but man, give me a break. Just eat some berries. There you go. All healed up. I could just use other Pokemon, but man, I just I want to evolve. I want to get to level 25. Q rough. Okay, ground rock. <coughs> probably doesn't have a lot of special effects. I probably could have used Dragon's Breath. Oh, that hurt. Oh, I don't like that. Belma wants to learn Roar. I'm good. We don't need Roar. I wonder what broken combinations there could be. Jealous wants to learn faint. I don't think so. Now I'm trying to think of something. Pid Tom. Oh, it's Pidgey and Rotom. Why is Pidgey a clock? I'm not understanding the connection between bird and clock. Oh, because it's like a cuckoo clock? Is that the joke? It's, it's a Rotom possessing a cuckoo clock with a Pidgey in it. Okay, so it's normal flying electric ghost, some combination of those. That took me a second. Oh, level 20! Alright, not even 25. Metang Dino is... It's got big fists. Mr. Fisto. Oh, that's cool. Metno. It's like a metal dino with psychic claws. They cannot see, so they tackle and bite to learn about their surroundings. It flies at over 60 miles per hour. Imagine something flying and biting everything at 60 miles per hour because it can't see while flying at 60 miles per hour. No, we don't want Roar. Get out of here. Confusion. Ooh, maybe. I'm not psychic type, though. Would it be worth getting over takedown? It is a normal type move. Which is not, obviously, super effective. I don't get stabbed from it, but it has been useful. Confusion's only 60 power. Uh... I think I want to keep takedown just because it hits it hits nice and hard. 
I already have the- I already have cat cat -a dude for Psychic. Mmm, Metal Claw, though. Oh, I need that because it's Steel-type. Alright, that will replace Takedown. Because that's going to be 75 power with Stab. I like this Pokemon. Uh, what is what are its attack stats? Uh, mostly physical. So I probably don't want Dragon Breath as its main attack. It is 90 power, but eh, it'll be fine. Slow man, Slowlax really needs to learn some moves. Something that is not purely in the interest of self-preservation. Slowlax needs to contribute. Honkarp. That looks weird. I don't know how Magikarp that looks. It just kind of like looks like Haunter's head was slapped on. Uh, ghost water or poison water? Ghost water. Spooky agua. Honkoth. Honedge and Slaykoth. Do you think that hurts scratching itself like that? I knew I'd lose too. What do you think of trading a Pokemon for one of mines? I'll take any poison type Pokemon. Uh, which of my Pokemon do you want? V Vino Cams? Venomoth and Ekans? Or Venomoth and Sandshrew? I'm assuming it's Venomoth, or it could be Ven Venipede. No, oh, sorry. No, Venipede, I think, is spelled with an I, so it's probably Venomoth. I still don't think I want to make that trade, though. <coughs> My boyfriend is cool. Pidow. I would have thought the Pidgey side would have evolved first. I guess you would still see a good number of fusions, even if you had wild fusions off. Just because most or all of the trainers have them. Kabura. It's Kabuto Abra. That's a little frightening. It, it's like an Abra who's hiding its face in some spooky, dark magic mirror. It's a Sailor Moon villain, as an Abra. Why don't we put one of our other 21s out for a little- Metno, you've done good, you've done your job. Oh, it's nighttime now, that means we'll have different encounters. I could go see what's on this route now. Pentasy. Still gonna be water poison. Just go ahead and get my uh, get myself built immediately. Unfortunately, Bug is weak against poison, but that's all right. Bull track. This is nice coverage. I have a I have a stab move with priority, and I have a stab move that never misses. 
Now, can I lure this guy out like I could in the original games? Oh, no, he's not going to do it. I can't get in early. I need cut. Hiker Wayne! Lit Fable. It looks like it's suffering. So, combination of normal fairy, ghost, and fire. Let me uh, counteract that burn a little bit. I forget how much burn lowers attack by. I'm gonna hope that it's fire type. And try aqua, aqua jet. It's not fire type. Which means it's ghost type. How dare you create such an abomination, hiker? Aerial ace? I don't have a flying move yet. That could be better for coverage than bug type, honestly. Oh, but then I'd ruin my nice theming of only having 40 power attacks. Uh, I do already have a move that... Oh no, never mind, they're both priority moves. I thought Shadow Sneak was a never-miss move. I should probably get rid of Fury. I, I think Fury Cutter's a tutor move. I think I can teach it somewhere anyway. Uh, I don't need Swagger. Catadude wants to learn self-destruct. No, you may not learn self-destruct. You look like you have some pretty cool Pokemon yourself. What do you think of having a trade with me? Right here, right now. Any Pokemon that's at level 17, four. Well, he said Oddix, but I don't know if it's actually going to be an Oddix. Oddish Onyx. Any Pokemon that start or end with the same few letters kind of aren't going to work great for this format. Or there's going to be a lot of Pokemon with, like, the same names. Alright. Bill's house. Where's his secret garden? How come I can like, be halfway on the roof. That's weird. Weird geometry, that. I've used RPG Maker, so I know how this stuff works, and it, it is kind of frustrating to see all of these pretty glaring oversights. These would all be things that are easy to address in RPG Maker. Alright, he's gonna... He's gonna attempt it. He's gonna do the Digimon fusion. He's gonna fuse himself with a Rhydon. That's no good at all. No, you're beautiful. You didn't see that, did you? Alright, I was, I was conducting a research on Pokemon fusion, but I might have screwed up. Wanted to see what would happen if you combined a Pokemon and a human, but now these claws are too big. And I can't operate the cell separating system to turn myself back. No. Oh, I want to, like, back off and look at your sprite better. I want to see your, your weird fusion face. Oh, I'm not going to get to see it. Well, we can kind of see it. He, he has a beard when he's fused, I guess. Bye. I guess this makes more sense if he was intentionally trying to fuse himself with a Pokemon. As opposed to he was trying to make a teleporter before. How did that ever pan out? I guess it didn't. Or we would have teleportation technology in the world of Pokemon. All we have are psychic Pokemon that can do it. Like that old man with the miraculous Abra.
He's been programming some kind of AI. Okay. Just usable PC up here. Uh, put Jillis out here. And then we'll head back, because there's, there's no shortcut. We gotta walk back the normal way. Let's head back and let's see what, uh, let's see what's on this route at night. I'm not gonna be going too, too much longer. It seems like we're going to go at about the rate of one of one gym per stream. So obviously this will be longer than something like Crystal Clear. But I don't want to play it off stream, because you know, I want to see all the fusions on stream. They're beautiful. They're beautiful and cute. It's the same as during the day. Now give me new night encounters. I guess it's one for one, so if a Pokemon is here during the day and the night in the vanilla game, I guess it's the same encounter in this way as well. This is just all the same encounters. I guess this, this route just doesn't have night encounters. It's odd because every other route in the game that I've been to has had completely different encounters for a day and night. Let's see what uh, what's here. This is where we found Beldum during the day. Uh, okay. The sprite issue was not resolved. There are still some sprites which are missing, I see. Do I want a Slugma? I don't think I'm gonna use a Slugma. I'm good. We're not gonna come, like, anywhere remotely close to seeing all the cool or funny fusions in this game. So honestly, it's, it's not really worth me catching anything that I'm not gonna, like, train, I feel. All the things I've caught so far have just been, like, sitting at my PC. Tell me a joke, joke teller. I taught my Pokemon a new HM. It made the cut. <sighs> you don't deserve a tip. But I'll give you one. There's a hundred bucks. Go go buy a McDonald's value menu item. Oh wait, they're they're not like a dollar anymore. Oh, this isn't going to be Dig. This is going to be a, uh, this is going to be a randomized TM. Unless it's guaranteed to be normal. Wait. Oh, this is a Team Rocket base. Never mind. We don't have, like, the criminal house. Uh... I can get this whenever. I can come back for a Moonstone. Team Rocket only watches Team Rocket TV. Nothing else. Weird looking chairs. I want to read the Team Team Rocket memo. Wait, why is the... Okay. I guess this is supposed to be them, like, them. Ra they ransacked the place and things are knocked over. That's what it's supposed to look like. What's in the hotel? Fifty dollars. Why would I rent a room? What can I do in a hotel bed? In this game. Trainers become stronger the more you rematch them. It's a great way to train up your Pokemon. Interesting. So rematchable trainers, it's not just the same team again. And it's not just two teams, it's like a, a whole series of teams, I guess. I brought back this special flute for my travels. Oh, okay. There's a flute guy for every badge. That's nice. 
white flute increases wild encounters. Some of these are really good to have. The, the flutes are like infinite status effect cures. And they work on status effects that uh, items don't. Obviously not these two. These two aren't status ones, but... Uh... I think there's one that works on confusion. There's one that cures attraction. There's a, uh, there's a Thought Be Gone flute. I'm going to the mart. I want to, uh, well, let me store the stuff that uh, might be useful to have. Probably never going to use the uh, stuff like the smooth rock, but you know, I'll keep it. <coughs> maybe I can get to, uh, maybe I can get to Vermilion before the end of the stream. That's not far. No, sell. Okay. Grass and caves handled easily. Bike shop. All right. How much you charging, bro? Want to buy a bike? I'll cut you a sweet deal. A measly a hundred thousand. Yes. Is it possible to get? that much. I wonder if that is within the uh, the amount that you can carry in this game. It, it wasn't in Gen 1. It was, no matter what you did, it was impossible to get the, uh, the price for the bike. I think it was actually ten times that number he just said. Oh, this is a whole route now, isn't it? Well, no, it's not that long a route. Trainers here. Pokemon, do I still have met? No. Alright. I've got a few trainers. I'm gonna check the wild Pokemon encounters. <coughs> Sable Purr. What does that look like? It looks like something. I, I th you know, it, I think it reminds me of the cat in Azumanga Dayo. The one with, like, the, the big chain chomp teeth. Okay, so it's ghost, dark, water, ground. Some com combination of those. Dragon Rage. Larv Purr. Is this just a whooper trainer? He just trains various fusions of whoopers. <coughs> that that's one that shares a, a prefix. Larvitar and uh, the 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 I forget what it's called. The Volcania thing, the pre-evolution. Volcarona pre-evolution. Faint attack. Dark type, it's not gonna have stab. I'm good with I'm good with those moves. I would like a better normal type move, but I do want a normal type move on it. Jigglymoth. Jigglypuff and Venomoth. Oh, it could be fairy. Dragon Rage might not work. Let's test it. Let's see if it's fairy. Oh good thing I chose a different move. It is not fairy type. Eh. That's fine. Another, another metal claw should do it. <coughs> Slowlax wants to learn bestow. That sounds like another support move. What does it do? It passes its held item to the target. Mm. Could be strategic if it holds a shitty item, but... Uh, I don't think I'm going to use that. My Pokemon is... Yeah! No, oh, you can get free eggs from breeders. I wonder if fusion Pokemon can come out of eggs. I assume not, but... What do I know? Sweet. 
socialite, Mathilda. Is that a way you just spell Matilda? Ingly, no. Again, going to assume it's fairy type first. It is not fairy type. But doesn't matter, because two metal claws will do it in anyway. I may have lost some of my skills. Hmm. Grandma gave me a cookie. I love you, Grandma. Hey, are you a trainer? Walking around? That small building there is the Kanto Underground. It goes under Saffron City all the way to Vermilion. Okay. She says Ratata for Poliwag, but is that actually the trade she's offering? I never know with the randomizer. Of course, the toll is a lie, but I'm defenseless. Could I actually go through here if I paid a toll? Or is this one of those impossible to pay tolls? Yeah, it, okay. Well, I'm, well, I'm one fifth of the way there to a bicycle or a Saffron City visit. I'm gonna guess the max money is, is five digits, though. It's 99999. Let's see what's in the grass on this route. Chimchar, which is a surprisingly common starter. We've seen multiple of those on multiple routes in multiple shuffles. Where's the other starters at? Can you, can you like Charmander? Or Trico? Where are the Mudkips at? Lampin, evolution of another Pokemon we've already seen. Is it... Is it one for one replacing families? I wonder. Like, uh, the Lampet family, maybe that's replacing the Pidgey line? Like, we would have found Pidgeotto here in the vanilla game? That's kind of a weird way to do it. I was hoping that every route would just have its own whole new table of Pokemon. But I guess that's not the way that this particular randomizer works. Oh, Shroomish! I kind of want that, because it, no, it learns Spore. I don't learn Spore really, really late, though. I'll get it. Paris learns Spore much earlier, so I would like to find a Paris. I kind of wish it was a male. I would have named it Walter. Uh, what are our shroomish sprites? Sprites. He's just got little, little different feet positions. This one's got the, the people's eyebrow. Angry sh shroomish. But it's like, these are the American shroomishes. These are the ones on the American box art. They don't get to be cute anymore. Alright, well that was a decent thing to find. Let's see if we can find one more new thing, and then we'll head south. Just more Chimchar. I think it's actually the, uh, I think it's the customization that, uh, messed with the custom trainer sprites feature. Like, they very recently added the, uh, changeable outfits and hats. And that made the uh, custom trainer sprites incompatible. Pokemon will lose some of their experience when they're when they defuse. Uh, <coughs> okay. So you really <coughs> sorry. You really don't want to defuse if you can help it. Why do 
All right, I'm not gonna do this. I would do this in the vanilla game to get like all the hidden ground items, but I, I don't care that much for this. Uh, I'm gonna focus on making sure I have the way to uh, the way to Vermilion open first. Which these guys always block. Don't despair, Vermilion City's right ahead. That's why we're gonna take you on right here. Ix. Pidgeopod. Ugh. A normal bug or flying bug. We're finally consistently starting to get evolved Pokemon. Granted, it's usually evolved Pokemon fused with low stat Pokemon to balance it out. Sea Key. Interesting. right next to me. I should take one. How dare you hang out just in front of a Pokemon Center waiting for weakened trainers. Dick move, Picnicker. How about what? No! No, let me go to the Pokemon Center and then I'll come back and have a fair fight with you. How about that? How dare I think that maybe this game had battle consent laws. Ferrarill. So it's Ferrothorn and Azuril. Azuril being fairy type, I think. It's not normal fairy, it's pure fairy. So it's fairy grass or fairy steel. Neither of which are great. I'm gonna hope it's fairy grass and metal claw will work. Okay, good. Ow. Ash's dad wants to learn light screen. Well, it's a move. Uh. Maybe I should change this thing's form. Maybe I should get the other one so that mine is on top. I don't think I would use light screen. Just because it's, it's a guess, especially with fusions. There's going to be so many Pokemon that are mixed attackers that just blocking one type of attack won't necessarily be amazing. Sableon. Sableon and Kecleon. Sableon and Kecleon. Does it have color change? It doesn't seem to. Metno is tough. I mean, it would be as two pseudo-legendaries, but... I'm glad I have this dude. No. No. here at this Pokemon Center. I see another Oak Aid. Maybe. Maybe it's, maybe it's just some nerd. I can teach you another wonderful move called Wonder Room. Nah. Again, less useful now since there's so many different Pokemon and so many different fusions. Something could very easily have... Well, no... I guess it wouldn't have necessarily amazing special defense and defense unless it were a... Uh... I guess it would depend on the fusion. I hooked up the Slowpoke with my good rod. I'll trade it for a, meow a Meowth. Eh. 
I would, I would kind of like a Slowpoke. I only have one Meowth, though, and I don't rem You know what? Even if I remembered where I got it, it wouldn't matter because that was before the reshuffle. I'm going to clear out the trainers. I'm going to walk around this route for a little bit and see what kind of uh, wild encounters are here. And then we'll call it. Okay. Gibsor, which is going to be Dragon and Grass or Dragon Poison. And Clefsley, which will be Rock Normal or Rock Fairy. Either way, Metal Claw will be super against it. Dragon Breath will be super against, uh, Gibsor. But Fairy will also be super, so I'll just, uh, I'll Metal Claw the Fairy. Oh, that's right, he doesn't have a Fairy move. Survive, Ash's dad. Pre preserve yourself. Metno's got this. Oh! Oh no, it knows Dragon Rage. Alright. Uh. Dragon Breath Gibsor, and I'll just, uh. Ash's dad is the fastest here, so I'll just. I'll, I'll pound this thing. Get confusion. punch the tree. Mm, nope, not very effective. Come on, Dragon Breath. Oh. Oh, she's, they, she's got more. Goliolu. That, that Dragon Rage really messed me up. Okay, Goliolu is gonna be fighting ground or fighting ghost. Either way, confusion will work. Good. If it just kept using Dragon Rage, I would have gone down so fast. That doesn't even hurt Metno. No. So one of them only had one Pokemon. Unless... Oh, he's about to send out something else. Booper. That's a good name. Well, it's, it's Budu and Wooper, so I guess it's Bupper. Bop. Uh, grass, water, poison, ground. Any combination of those. Dragon Rage. And none of them are immune to Psychic, so... It's not poison, it's grass something. we lost together. I did most of the work. That's a functional couple. That's a sign of a good relationship right there. Slash S. What time is it? Okay, 8. Almost 9 p.m. So it's gonna be, uh... That's the, that's the road to Saffron. That's gonna be blocked. It's gonna be night for a while. Bulbarita and Pidgepix. While we're seeing a lot of the starters, we're just not finding any to catch. Okay. Fire normal or fire flying. And grass or grass. No, it's gotta be grass poison. don't want double team. Jillis' moves are in high demand. It could be useful as, like, a catcher, 
if I just want to survive longer against a Pokemon that's, like, troublesome. Yep, you know what? I'll, I'll do that. Slowlax. Learn moves. Get something. I might have to look up how Mime Jr. evolves. Because if it is a move, I want to be sure that I learn it and don't skip over it. Alright, Graveler and Kadabra is... Kadaler. Oh no, it has body image problems now. Kinesis. That lowers accuracy, I think. Yeah. I got Mud Slap. I'm good. Doesn't affect flying types, but... Eh. I think there's one more trainer that I haven't fought. It's that bug dude out there. Ooh, Combuskin. It's not first form, but it is a starter that I don't have yet. I'm gonna wait until I can get Jillis out first, because I don't want to switch in and get, like, eat a fighting move. Hello, Mr. Bugcat. Come here. Now you come to me. Have a look at my bug Pokemon. Are they really going to be bug Pokemon? Lampto. That's Lampent and Ditto. Not an ounce of bug in that thing. Uh, okay, 50 50. It's either Ghost no Well, if it's Ghost Normal, then Ghost won't work on it. So I guess I gotta bank on it being Fire Normal. It's Ghost Normal. What an annoying type Ghost Normal is. I've said this a few times. The first Ghost Normal we got was the uh, Hisuian Zoroark? Zoroa? Which it's like a spirit. Like a Shinto spirit, so I guess that makes sense. But uh, I thought Ghost Normal would have been a great typing for that cut voodoo Pokemon in the Pokemon Gold Beta. There was a voodoo doll that evolved into a, uh, like, Zhangxi panda. Both of those are great options for a normal ghost. A voodoo doll and a zombie. I'm good. I don't need Pursuit. No one ever swaps out their Pokémon in this game. Why would I learn Pursuit? Alright. Let's see if we can catch that Combuskin. Normal ghost. Yes, uh, ghost is immune to normal, and normal is immune to ghost, so it's one of the rare typings that has two type immunities. It's also uh, immune to fighting, which would normally be normal's weakness, but because it's ghost, you can't hit it with fighting type either. Seems like a pretty good type combo. Actually, it also protects it from its own, because Ghost is weak to Ghost. It's protected from that weakness as well. So it's protected from two of the types that you would normally use to deal with it. Oh, great. We're having an accuracy battle. I attempt another... I kind of don't want to attempt another Thundershock. I think that would probably... Oh, it's close. I'm gonna go for it. Okay. Perfect. Pokeball. That was a Jackie Chan Adventures episode about, like, a, a Zhang-Chi 
uncatchable vampire curse. I don't remember a ton about it, I just remember it being an interesting episode. We don't get a lot of Zhang Chi in, uh, in fiction. I also don't remember how lore accurate it was. If 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 the Zhang Shi in that episode had to like hop. Uh The flying kick is cool. I guess it's adapted from trading card game art, but I I kinda I I, I like the official ones. Young Foul. Flashes out with ten kicks per second. All right, well, that's a good find on this route. Is there anything else cool here? I already have a smoochum. What? No, I, I didn't catch the smoochum. Never mind. I guess I should catch it then. How much will Thundershot do? I'm ten levels ahead of it. Uh, more than I can use two of them. I wonder how much Fusion Balls sell for him. Do you still have uh, rough skin? No, it has no guard. Did I get the choice to choose its ability? I think... I should have. I don't think I did, though. I think the... Uh, I think the, the DNA refuser things, I think they changed its ability, too. I could have used it having, uh, having rough skin right now. What can I use against Smoochum? Slow, Slowlax, you're finally gonna be useful. You weak piece of shit. Oh wait, is it, is it Ice type yet? Oh, if it is Rock Smash, it's gonna be neutral. Oh, it is. It's Psychic Ice. I thought it was pure Psychic, and it gained Ice when it evolved. get a whole bunch of new encounters on a lot of routes as soon as I have Surf. Alright, this one should eat more from Thundershock. It's three levels lower. That's only a little more, though. I don't even know why I'm catching this. I'm not going to train it. I'm not going to fuse it. I'm not going to evolve it. What does Lickitung Smoochum look like? The Tongue Kiss Pokemon. Ugh. Get in the ball. Come on. There you go. That's fine. He's seat Pokemon. I think we've almost filled up box one? Maybe not. We probably have a couple rows still left. Alright, now give me something besides Smoochum and Combuskin. It's gotta be a third third thing. Okay, it's Whirlipede. Evolved Venipede. Kind of don't care about that. 4.21 a.m. Let me draw up time to check what's there in the morning. We're not done yet. We'll check the morning encounters. 20 minutes. 16 minutes. 12 minutes.
It's not even like a minute per second. It's faster than that. It's nice. I'm glad that time passes fast in this game. It's a whole lot more convenient than the actual series where you have to wait for like real time time. Hmm. Nose pass. That's tempting. But I, I kind of think like a female nose pass with a mustache would be a little weird. So. I know I'm too picky about this. I know it's weird and I know it doesn't matter. I like thematically gendered Pokemon, okay? <sighs> Do I dare Fury Swipes? Yeah. Even though it's a rock type, if it does like four or five, that's gonna kill it. Those paths can be a little tough to catch, though. Stay in the ball. Early riser nose pass. They should have left off the, the second S. So it was more obvious that it was supposed to be a compass. Like nose pass. Then again, that doesn't really like uh that's not really a pun. They just kind of put the word nose on it. Ooh, ooh, yes! It's gotta be Godzilla, though. I, I need to find a male Larvitar. Igly buff. Why not? I hope I don't kill it with a Thundershock. Like, Nosepass Nose Pass really isn't much of a, a portmanteau, or pun, or anything. I think. Like, I think it's supposed to be a play on Compass. I don't know what else it would be. Come on, just stay in the middle. Get in the stupid ball. I've had Igly Nuff. Alright, what time is it? It's still morning, right? That one's so much brighter. Is that like the Gen 2 sprite? Alright, time. Alright, it's still morning. We're good. Let's catch a Larvitar and then stop. Oh, I, I gotta train a Larvitar. What am I gonna fuse that with? It might be time to replace Ash's dad. I guess. It, maybe when he evolves, I'll replace him. I'll look in, I'll, I'll double check how Mime Jr. evolves. If it's gonna be like reasonably soon, then uh, then I'll do that. Because once he's Mr. Mime, he's fully evolved. We'll, we'll have the Mr. Mime Smeargle Fusion. Which isn't even that great. I don't know why I have a Smeargle on the team. I, I like Smeargle. Why do I keep saying Smeargle? I like Smeargle. But you really have to kind of, like, have a competitive plan with him for him to be interesting. We haven't even gotten the chance to use Sketch once. Come on, Larvitar. Is morning over? It's still morning. Fortunately, time is not... Like, in any way, it's not continuous. It's not based on a real clock or anything. So if I uh, quit and reload, it will be the time at which I saved. 
which was great because that's what I needed to do to catch uh, when I was trying to catch Belba off, off stream because it was a morning encounter. I wonder if Nose Pass and Larvitar have a fusion. I'm not going to do that, but uh, Godzilla with a mustache. I guess I could do this off stream. I can just come back next time with a Larvitar. If we don't get this one, then I'll do that. I'm not gonna reset and like and and keep just doing that because it's kind of boring to watch. Uh, <clears throat> all right, I'll. Ah, uh, oh, because it's ground. That's right. Well, in that case. Static probably won't work on it. I maybe I should maybe I should use Yawn with Slowlax. I'm a little worried that 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 uh, Rock Smash is gonna kill it though. I'm gonna go for it. I'm gonna try a Rock Smash because. It's not Chansey's attack stat, though. It's Vigoroth's. It's actually a decent attack. Ten levels ahead. It's not Stab. Okay, good. It's good. It's low HP. It's gonna be asleep. It looks like it's got lipstick. It looks like it's got a little Frieza smile. I know that's not the idea. It's supposed to be like it's open mouth. It just, I, I don't interpret it that way. Stay in the ball, Larvitar. That's a good point. Alright. Slowlax, you were finally useful for once. Uh, trading card game. Opera Singer Larvitar. Uh, apparently... That's, that's a weird looking one. I think that's the Gen 2 sprite? I kind of like that, like, updated Gen 2 sprite. Uh, Jack is saying I may be having network issues. I think the stream dropped. So, uh, sorry to anyone who is watching live who, uh, won't hear this, but, uh, Fortunately, I'm recording separately, so it'll be fine on uh, fine on YouTube. Anyway, that's it for today. If I'm not live right now, then uh, to those who are watching the VOD, thank you for watching. Tomorrow is Saturday. I don't know if Jack will be around or up for anything. I don't know if I will stream anything. If so, it might be another one of this, because I really don't want to go back to Trials. I'm, I'm a, kind of in a crappy part of Trials. Uh, who knows? Might stream Saturday, might stream Sunday. But, thank you for watching. I'll see you next time.